Emergency. Are you okay? Emergency. Are you okay? Emergency. Are you okay? Sorry, please. Sorry. Emergency. Please don't. My king. Let's just be honest. No. Please, no. Call the queen. Please inform the queen. Okay. Sorry. Emergency. Sorry. Sorry. Please wait for me. Father, this is the seventh time the doctor will be saying the same thing. Exactly. I mean, I don't know how else to make your father understand that his health status can no longer handle the stress of being a king. You are very hard working. But, but we. I need you. I want you to stay alive and see my unborn children, your unborn children, the ones I'm yet to give you. Yeah. But I cannot just abandon my throne. Abandon your throne? How can you say that when you have three airport sons? Exactly. Hey King, you have, you have Onika. Onika can take over the throne while you get better. What did you just say? I, I, I'm sure he will, do, he will do just fine. He will rule just like you. Is that a joke or what? L listen, Norma, I will not! Opia oh, Chiru. I will not have you address me by my first name. I am your queen. And that doesn't give you the right to decide who sits on my father's throne. Well, I have watched the three of you over the years. And I know Onyeka will be a better king than any of you. That must be the joke of the century. But you know what? I won't exchange words with you in front of my father. You are not the kingmaker after all. An ordinary maid. 
you do not have a right to interfere in anything that goes on in this palace, not even the affairs of the royals. Yes, my queen. Look at me. You are not royal. Now get out. <laughs> The next time you try this rubbish, you will leave here in pieces. Yes, my queen. So angry. Eh, nigga, I hate that woman with passion. I hate her so much. And I swear to God, nigga, one day, one of these days, I will someone of the courage to slap her back when she slaps me. Do you know how many, how many slap I don't chop for that woman had? Every time she goes, slap me less than she bought me. <laughs> you didn't realize it's the queen you're talking about, right? So, I don't care. I don't care if she's the queen. She, she even calls me a common maid. <laughs> well, that's all we are. We are maids. I know we are maids. Right? I know we are maids. But the way she says it, it sounds like we are just slaves in this palace. <laughs> okay, sorry. So, for you too. Why were you eavesdropping in their conversation? It's rude. See this woman? Who do they speak English for? If you were the one who overheard them, Talking about the, somebody that will take over the throne, will you not his job? Sabi sabi. Eh? Discussing such when the king is still alive. Which alive? Obviously, the king is too sick to rule, so he wants one of his sons to take over, and that's when Yege Queen is uh, 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 fighting for Onyeka. But Obi says no. He doesn't want it. Blah, blah, blah. They were just saying so many things. So why won't I listen? But this is somehow. This is somehow. Because it's neither the rights of Onyeka nor Obi. Everyone knows is the first son. He's the heir to the throne. First son? Mm -hmm. Have I no vessel? Which first son? Prince Chooks now. <laughs> I beg no vexo, make I ask you one question. Since you start to work for this palace, you don't ever carry this your two eyes. See first song. I, 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 I've seen his pictures, but that still doesn't change the way that he... I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Make a hear what? I've seen his pictures, it doesn't say... Wait, wait, they talk of people in their life, they talk of person where we don't vote, the person where nobody they hear a name again where they are abroad. Who fit be king?
Obi, my brother. Why is he calling you this early? Uh, babe, it's past 11 already. Whatever. <sighs> oh. Hello, Obi. Chokes. I know you. You just woke up. Probably partied all night and definitely having a hangover right now. Can you go straight to the point? Father is sick. What? How serious? As serious as having to hand over the town affairs to someone else. So, um, I don't understand. Someone has to be king. And you, you are the heir to the throne now. Did you hear what I said? Um, yes, yes, Obi. Um, but you know, uh, are you expecting me to, to live my life here and live every, all the good things and then come back to, to, to rule a land? Come on, Obi, that, that is more like you. So I think you should probably go ahead and, and, and become the king. Are you serious? Obi, I'm not coming to Nigeria to become no goddamn king. So you go ahead. That's more like you, Obi. Like I said, go ahead. I think I think you should be the king. You should take over the throne. Listen, Chooks. It is not as if I am trying to take what traditionally belongs to you. But if you don't want it, I'll take it because someone has to be king. Yeah. It's okay, Obi. Just just do your thing. Go ahead. Like I said, I'm too modern to become a king. True, so. Just na man you be. Just na man you be. Believe me. Hi! Just you be my blood. I got your back. In fact, I beat my chest. I beat my chest, talker. You be my blood. And please, take care of that, okay? I got your back. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. <laughs> Can you imagine? Oh they want me to live all the good life, all the parties, I mean, all the strip clubs. <laughs> Babe, all the trips and go become a king. I Come want on. you to leave America. Go most, back to Nigeria. <laughs> most of all, leave oh this beauty. <laughs> mm. Oh, babe. Mm -hmm. No way. <laughs> Wake up. It's morning. No way. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ho! See who is going to be the next king of Amako Kingdom. Then look at me. Waleleno King. Can the world observe this king? Hi. Ah, uh, I have to, everything has to change. Obi Adjuru can never be king. Ome me me, never. Whether you like it or not, I am the next in line. So hmm. nobody, not even you, can change. 
injured. Did you see the way he talked to me? If we go see Agwamogu, do you realize it is the queen of this land you are talking to that way? Mm -mm. I will be let him be. Let him talk to me the way he likes. After I am young, you feel you can insult me. Well, Obiajuru, you might not like me. That is none of my business. But you have to respect me. I am your father's wife, the queen, your queen, Obiajuru. Kingmaker, we all know that the heir to the throne is Chooks. Hmm. But now, Chooks is not available and he has refused to return to the country. I am the next in line, so... It is not a thing of who is next in line or who is not next in line. It is about who is capable of sitting on this throne. And you, Opia Juru, you do not possess those qualifications. Even when you can knows that I am more capable. Mm -hmm. I, Onyeka, is the capable one. Uh -huh. Inugia. What did you just say? I want to be king. You must be out of your mind. <laughs> What do you even think? That you're the only one that deserves good things? <laughs> I see. You are beginning to grow wings. And she is the one backing you up. But guess what? Over my dead body will you be crowned. Mm -mm. So if you know what is good for you, get that imagination of sitting on the throne out of your mind. Obiajulu! Did you see who you want to make king? Somebody who is not just rude, but bad-tempered. He even walked out on you, Amobi. Ephoria? Amobi. Ada Bukwani is you, Kwaka. Let's not keep going around the bush. Let's just go straight to the point. It is obvious. Even the blind can see that Onika is fit to sit on this throne. He is not just well-mannered, he is wise and gentle. What else are you looking for in a king? Kediyoza Nacho. You startled me. Onika, stop it. Just stop it. Someone might walk in. Okay, just give me a kiss. No. I thought we agreed on seeing each other only at night. Yes. But I want it now. That's not possible. Do you want me to lose my job? Look, Ugo, nobody can sack you from this palace. Very soon, this whole palace and the entire town will be in my hands. But when I become king, you'll be my queen. Are you sure? Are you sure you're not going to leave me for someone else when you become king? Leave you for who? You're the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Now give me a kiss. <laughs> My prince, 
Why are you the one cleaning the kitchen? What was happening here? Nothing you should be concerned about. I hope it isn't what I'm thinking. Oh, you better don't do anything silly. See, Neka, mind your business. Are you my mother? What is your business with what I do with my life? See, them share this work. Face yours Why I face mine. Do you understand? Pass, I'll move your leg. This is not gonna happen, Chooks. It's not. So you better drop the idea. Why are you making a fuss out of this anyway? I haven't even decided. I'm still contemplating. Then stop contemplating. Just stop. You wanna leave me here and go all the way to Nigeria just to become a king? <sighs> but you know I don't like all of this. But I cannot just sit back and watch someone else take over my birthright. To hell with the birthright. You don't even care about that shit. What? You just called my father's throne shit? It's not like you care about your father anyways. You are the black sheep of the family. You said so yourself. Well, maybe. This is the right time to become a responsible son. And just maybe, all I have to do is to just sit on the throne. Read my lips. That is not happening. And don't try me, Chooks, because you know I'm crazy. Look, your craziness will not stop me from doing whatever I have to do. For real. You can do anything! Anything but going to Nigeria just to become a king? Watch me. Don't you dare walk out of me! Chooks! Chooks! Yeah. 